Hello friends, this is Umesh Sharra and today we will create this 3D knot model in KTI V5 using wireframe and separated design. So first I have to create this 3D knot curve then I will apply some rib or any sweep command so that I can create it properly. So I will start from this, this is a triangle and 10.1 is the size of this triangle. So let's start with the cat here. Okay. <clears throat> so select a sketch command and this is the sketch. And my working plane is this XY. And I'm trying a rectangle. Sorry, triangle. Now dimension it. And this dimension is 10.1. And again 10.1 and again so my sketch is fully defined now I need a center point and for center point I am using tri tangent circle and make this circle as a reference because I need a point only now select it and make it dotted or reference line right now go to wireframe and here I am using line command and this is the point and direction is Z so click here and enter Z and this distance I am entering 15 approximately okay now I need some plane so from plane definition I am going to use uh, point and line and my point is this and line is this one point will one plane will come repeat this again and the same option my point is this and plane is this and click ok alright so now I have three points and three plane this is already uh, here so no need to create it again now I want to project this point over this line or I can use this intersection okay so intersection my first element is this and second element is this and click okay so this uh, projection point will automatically create and go to this plane and I need one more plane so uh, sorry through point parallel through point this plane should be placed here okay now I have three this extra plane and by default plane is already there and now uh, I need a arc okay this lower one arc I'm going to start so go to this uh, circle and here arc and I'm using center and the point so center point is this one and start point is this and my support support plane this plane will work as a support Okay. so I'm starting from here to here so this 180 degree is the angle right now for the next again I'm using this and this time my center point so my center is this and I want to start from here and my support will be this and no it is not properly so drag this one drag this also and make this 21 as 0 and this angle as 90 degree and let's see so it is coming up to the center line okay see this is what I have now I am going to extend this line so use line and this time my type is tangent to curve and select this point right and sorry again tangent to curve so select the curve first okay and the reverse direction and make this line as a 10 m see here we have 10 so this 10 I am counting okay see this one right put it like this now for next line I'm going to create one more line here this line so users line 
and the I am using point and direction my point is this and the direction is the Z so click this one and uh, this length for this length click here right click right click under this and I want to measure so measure between my value is from this to this it should be equivalent to this click and the length will automatically adjust okay so this line is now created <clears throat> drag it here now I am going to project this point over this line so that I will get a point on this line so use this project and I want to project this point over this line and let's see okay so this is the point draw a plane and the line and the point so perpendicular plane will come and hide this one okay hide this one right so I have this point now I'm going to use this point so use the arc and uh, center point so this point will work as a center and I want to start from here and my support plane is this and drag it up to the 180 degree okay 180 degree and click okay so this is okay this is what I have created now go to this arc and uh, this time my center will be this point is this and for plane plane I am using this one this plane yz click and I don't want from here I want this here so 27 make it 0 and here 90 degree I am using 90 right now extend this line so I am using a line and same tangent curve and this is the curve and the point is this and 10 enter this value is 10 see this one so my knot is now complete hide unnecessary string or if you want to use this join command directly so I can use select 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 so this is my 3d knot okay and for surface for surface I can use this sweep and this center and the radius in the th third option and click this curve and the dimension is 2.5 is a radius so I'm using 2.5 as a radius and click OK and see the result okay if you want to make it solid so hide this and uh, right this point you circle and center in the radius complete circle point support is this plane and 2.5 is a radius and go to part design and rib use this rib section and the curve okay see this so hope you understand this how to create thank you for watching have a nice day